COVID-19 is affecting at least six schools in the Philadelphia School District. They are fully paused because of outbreaks. Those schools are the Ethan Allen School in Mayfair, Abram Jenks School in South Philly, the John Welsh School in Kensington, the Samuel W. Pennypacker School in West Oak Lane, James J. Sullivan School in Frankfurt, and Randolph Technical High School in Nicetown. In addition, Olney Charter High School shifted to remote learning today following a mass teacher call out. Eyewitness News reporter Jasmine Payu is at school district headquarters with more on this. Hi, Jasmine. Hi, Jess. Elena's family sent us a statement saying they stand in solidarity with the teachers, and Elena would be fully supportive of this decision if she was here today. I don't think that this was the time or the way to go about this. It's a clash over COVID-19 safety guidelines that has Philadelphia's largest high school at odds with its teachers and their union. For the teachers who called out, I don't blame them. You just want to be safe. Monday, more than 40 educators called out at only Charter High School in what administrators are calling a mass call out over safe environments. The move comes nearly a week after 12th grader Elena Thatch died from COVID-19. It's understandable. <laughs> It is. The union that's representing them, AFT, says our union unequivocally did not organize what management are labeling a mass call out. However, in the aftermath of a student death, ONLY'S management should have been more proactive in moving to fully virtual learning before last night. I think that we actually go far above and beyond with our um, our protocols anytime that someone uh, does identify themselves as having uh, COVID. The surge in cases not only concerning these teachers. The Philadelphia Department of Public Health says Randolph Technical High School has been shut down for 48 hours. And currently, five schools, Ethan Allen, Abram Jinks, John Wealth, Penny Packer, and Sullivan, are fully paused due to COVID. Clearly, um, we are seeing, obviously, as we are seeing across you know, the world, an uptick in cases, and we are being mindful of that. But and with COVID 19 being their biggest battle, the principal of Omni Charter School says this disagreement is another thing they'll have to put behind them. There's a lot more that we could be focusing on. Only Charter says they offer additional nursing, rapid testing, and contact tracing, and are 100% sure Elena did not get the virus from school. We're live at school district headquarters. Jasmine Payute, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Jasmine, thank you.